A little late, but she's back. What's up? Heritage Park was nuts today. It's crazy, holy. But um, I got some very cool footage. 2023's light was in operation, so you get to see that. But yeah, due to watch. the crowds today, all stations were being stopped at one by one each time. The every second station thing they did not do today because the crowds were even at Lagan and Lagan never gets any big crowds normally. But they had markets there today. It was busy, it was hot. It was lots of fun though, it was really cool. Like I had a good time. And um, just, uh, just updating you guys on the old ranger, she is good, but... Um, Sometime in the foreseeable future, she's gonna have to be replaced. So no, but don't mean to bust the whistle a little bit, but the yeah. transmission <sighs> is um need, needs a little TLC. Mm -hmm. I find a high speed your transmission is good though. It's just getting going. That's true. But anyway, she's still kicking. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but there bad. may be a few vlogs way in the foreseeable future where where my friend here might have a different vehicle. I might. But for now, we're still rolling with the Danger Ranger. Who parked here? This is not a parking spot. Whatever. People are so silly. Not my issue if they... I don't know. Uh, but anyway, uh, we had a good Heritage Park experience. And... Um, Unfortunately, Brooklyn will not be with me on railway days, but I will be going there on Saturday, so yep. um, stay tuned for that. And I heard the boat, and then another update, we just heard the boat today as we were leaving, so it may be running. But I'm not 100% Yeah, certain. so apparently Ethan told me that that boat runs on vegetable oil, which is interesting. Well, I mean, I the oil, but okay. Well, I mean, maybe the, maybe the real thing did though too, right? That's true. Yeah, it's very true. Okay. But um, as you may know, I haven't had, I haven't done any update videos on, on the, um, on the park equipment. Um, the boat was down for about more than a month. Yeah. Because what? It's have you ever been on the boat? I did. I have things too loud. Like when they blow the horn. Mm -hmm. Train whistles are fine because I love mm -hmm. trains. Right. Uh, but anyway, um, they had some type of mechanical issue with the motor, one of the parts. Yeah. And that particular week, I went on the 31st of like, um, of July, and a couple days later, went on Heritage Park's site and found that the boat was broken. Sorry, I'm just trying to focus on getting out of here, that's all. Because they block off on everything. Oh, they turn the light off. Yeah, they're really not letting people through here. So we're going to do a little detour. It's okay. Haven't done it before. It's not like we haven't. See, at high speed, your transmission behaves fine. It's just... It's a low speed that gets it. Well, I mean, I mean, gonna be a 19-year-old truck here in months. It's true. It's true. I'm gonna, I don't think I can pull a Yui up here, so I'm gonna have to... Ah, uh, yeah, I wouldn't. Let's not do that. Not risk that. Are we still gonna have to take Glenmore? Yes, right? Yeah, yeah but we gotta go the opposite way. Oh, everyone's pulling you turns, but we're not gonna do that. But anyway, we had a good time at Heritage Park. Sure did. It was one for the books. 
good experience. Never done that. Actually, I've done it once, but I never actually got to enjoy Heritage Park because I only went for my grade 9 graduation like 8 years ago or something. So it's been a while. The train was probably running there that day then. I don't think... Well, it was in the evening. It was after park hours. Oh, so it so wouldn't... it wasn't. No. So I've never seen that train run, actually. Now but I have. And as you guys know, there's two 24s in the shop. Yep. Getting ready for railway days. And what I might do if 2024 is du double heading after the double header's over, I might stay on on 2023 just so I can get some action or like get get pulled by her for the one last time. Yeah. In case. Just in case. Uh, just in case I don't see her for the rest of the year. Right. Yeah. So. Beautiful day with all the people there. It was hot. It was hot. Yeah, we were saying it, it was like 28 degrees or something, but I think it got up to around 30 just because everybody was there and it was. So because crowded. at Shepherd there was probably 120 people at the train exactly. platform. Exactly. We were even discussing about going on a weekend, but but instead of doing that. Um, you know, we were discussing on going the weekend and Saturday came up and this was the only day she was available, which was totally fine. It's totally good. We made work made it work, didn't we? It's all good. Yep. And hopefully the train will be back on regular schedule when they but um once it's not so busy yeah. then it even on railway days, they stop at every second station. Mm. That'll be that'll be better because then you get a little bit more time actually riding the train and not just stopping and starting. Because you don't get to enjoy it as much. Although I did enjoy it, it was fun. But uh, the um, double header this year will be a bit different. They'll be going in that direction yeah. we were going today. Last year it was the other way. Where you would go Shepherd, right. Mindapur, Lagan, but now it's Shepherd, Lagan, Mindapur. Mm -hmm. True. So they usually turn it the other way? Halfway through the year, they switch the direction. Oh, and the purpose is like so you're not wearing out the other side of the track, so they switch, switch out the direction of the train. Interesting. Yeah, that's what I thought. Lights are out here too. Oh my god, just to make it worse, eh? That's insane. Amusement part of the park is not open until 9 o'clock, but the park itself where they have the markets yeah. will be open to the uh, uh, will be open to the public. Mm -hmm. And the train departed Mindapur today at 4.58, which it normally doesn't. But yeah. due to leaving people behind, it had to do an extra run today. Yeah. So are your subscribers, do they most of them in Calgary, or are they all over the place? I wouldn't really say they're all, all here. Maybe all over the place. You don't yeah. know, right? Sure, I guess yeah. not. Yeah, I kind of have to talk because I don't want to get, I don't want to get copyrighted with the music, which is kind of. Um, that's okay. Sort. I just shut it off it's anyway. just like that's the one thing that's annoying about YouTube. You can borrow a song, right. but if you hear a song when you're doing a video, they do it. Really? Like it's really annoying. That's so. That's so annoying. But then again, the YouTube has made me all the memories, though. Of course. It's good you get to keep all of these memories. Because eventually 2023 will not be around operating on. I mean, like, um, in the foreseeable future, because it'll be harder and harder to maintenance. Right. Right. 
as you see her talking there, the clutch was really slick. Yeah, yeah, and you saw that, right? It was like, I don't know how to describe it, but the clutch was slipping a little bit. Look at the people coming in. Yeah, I'm glad that we went when we did, you know, like it was still very busy. It probably would have even been better to go earlier, but, but I want to honestly, sit. right now, I this want, is crazy. I wanted to sit and have a break. Even if we would have left over, it would have been the same thing. It would have made. I don't think it would have made any difference. No, I agree. Well, guys, back for railway days next weekend. Yeah, you are. And then I'll. With your other friends. Yeah. Nice. Um. But anyway, um, and then I'll probably go back once more. Um, when the um. Before the year finishes. Of course. Because what time? When do? When does the year finish? October 9th is the last day. Oh, okay. Interesting. But then again, I can't go through the week because the weekends only. Right, right. Yeah. So you only have very few weekends left. Yeah. Only a month, so about four or five weekends. I'm glad I got to spend time with the most wonderful person in the world. Who me? Yeah. And, um, and, uh, she's talking about traveling sometime in the foreseeable future, which is understandable. Yeah. You know, you, they say, I'm going to say, I, I took, I took one of it, one of my friends, from one of my friends, she has her Instagram, you know, you have your feed, right? Yep. The quote she said on there, mm. um, Life is too short, so make it sweet. That's very true. You gotta live your life, and because it'll just pass you by. If Are we supposed living, to go that life. way to Chestermere, right? Oh my god, we totally were, weren't we? Yeah. <laughs> anyway, a little extra time with you never hurts. Whoops. It, go, it, okay. it goes too fast though. Me and her have too much fun. I know. Like I literally, it's been almost five hours, and it doesn't feel like that long. So silly me. I was supposed to get you Oh well. You're a bunch of sunshine today. I can say that. Thanks, buddy. Appreciate that. She sends me the most adorable texts too. And I always cry in happy t tears. I, I love her emojis though. I think they're cool. Yeah. Sometimes she's up when I'm up at like two in the morning, and we're just Not like. Not very often. I'm I'm kind of more of a sleepyhead these days. Well, I mean, Sometimes back when she was working at Captis, you kind of got yeah. used to the routine. I did. So I took a while to message you back. Oh, I was um. Didn't I always take a while? Yeah. I'm always so busy. <laughs> but like you said, it's better to stay busy than not, right? Yeah. I wonder. Oh, uh, is this road closed? Why is every road closed? Oh my god. No left turn. Okay. Okay, we're taking a little detour. We're basically on crow child right now. Yeah. Crow child. Um, oh my god, this is such a long detour. It's okay. That's fine. Five extra minutes is not going to hurt nobody. Um, I get flashbacks. We're right by camp right now. In fact, is she used to volunteer. I know. It's true. Although camp finished on the 25th, they went right till the end almost. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, we're approaching Central Memorial High School. Exactly, yeah. You can take bus 13. Um, as far as to Glenmore Aquatic. Mm. I remember that place. 
Oh, Between Friends does not do it anymore. They go to South Calgary Pool or oh, really? or um, Stanley Park. Mm. Stanley Park is good. I remember you were my group once when we did that walk. We went swimming at Glenmore one time. Remember that? Yeah. We went swimming at the YCMA, uh, YMCA. YMCA, and in which one was it? Uh, Saddle Ridge, I believe. Yeah, some, uh, yeah. Saddle Ridge. I don't remember exactly. Something like that. But they didn't have floats, so she had to take me in her arms because they had no floaty things. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I remember that. That was a long time ago. You must have been like... 2015. Like, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, probably. About that. You were in my group a lot more in 2016. Yeah, because I think I requested to be in your group because I liked hanging out with you. But remember when you surprised me one day in 2015? You didn't tell me how group, uh, what group you were going to be in and they put you mm -hmm. with that. Uh, Hmm, let me just see though. I think I might have been in 2016. I was a coyote, I think. Coyote. Yeah, that sounds right. Coyote. Yeah, because. Yep, that sounds right. Yeah, 16 and 17, I was yeah. caught. Uh, the years I was coyote. Yeah. And then 18 and 19, I was a grizz. Grizzly. Yeah. Camp was so different when I came back in 2017. Not for like me, but not having you there. Like, um, not having you there was so different. I know, right? Because when I met you in 2011, up right until 2016, we were... Yeah. But then again, you were going in your what? Grade 11 year or something, so high school was yeah. busy and... Sounds about right. Yeah, lots going on. So and I imagine September will be busier for you as well. I think a little bit, yeah. I find summer's your busiest though. It is with my work and stuff that I do now. Because you're not going to get a lot of clientele in the winter. I'm going to miss her a lot if she travels for a couple months. But don't panic, guys. She'll still be up here a lot. Yeah. And we'll still do the vlogs. You know what I do when I'm having a bad day? I throw one of our vlogs on. Aw, that's sweet. That's really nice. I laugh at the top where my chair was bouncing around. Last year, when we hung out on the 24th, I think it was of August, and you and me are going back and forth with each other. Yep. Your hair's grown back, I noticed. It has, and I'm thinking about chopping it again. I might cut it short again. I don't know. I'm chopping mine off in are a you? few days. In a few days? How short are you going to get? Like a buzz cut? Like, you know the length when you saw me last time? That length. That's a good length. That, that looks good on you. Even this beard, even though it's a little longer, it yeah. looks good. It does. Are you going to keep the beard? No. If oh. the haircuts go... It just gets itchy, right? And food gets stuck in yeah. it. That makes sense. Are you just going to shave it all off then? Yep. Or not like all because if you go down to the wood it's growing again within less than a day so there's no point. So you get it all uh, you get a lot of it off like 80%. Yeah. 80, 85 and then you leave 15. Yeah. Makes sense. She always likes to push the truck to the limit on Glenmore which is always fun. 
I find Happy Speed for Ranger is her is her favorite. Yeah, true. I find your trucks like high speed more in your truck. It does. It's at low speed, it's just like. And um, I'm fortunate. It's not really unfortunate, but no, we broke it. The tradition of going to village because we were just at Heritage all day. Yeah. So. It would have been too long. But next time, maybe we'll go to Village if it's nice up still. We can always do an inside activity because when I see you in however long time, it's going to be probably cold. Probably going to be cold, yeah. Thanks for picking me up and taking me back. It's You're just welcome. my dad's watch. I know you never really asked, so I just assumed. Yeah. I'm like, for here to park day, I kind of need that, though. Yeah. It's easier, just because, like, it would be too hard for your dad to come and try and pick you up in that. Thank you for being home. understanding. Of I course. mean, yeah. especially today, there's no way in hell he would be able to get in unless he wanted to wait 20 minutes. I know. It's insane. Like, we're already... Yeah, not with that. And Glenmore's busy today, kind of, because yeah. of the trap. Uh, a lot of this is coming from here to Park. Yeah. That's true. It's time to go get some maintenance done and go gas up. I need it. My boiler's a little cold right now. Your so what? My boiler's a little cold right Are now. My, right? En my engine... But I suck for eating in the afternoon. I like, I am not an afternoon eater. No? You just like having a big meal at dinner? Unless if I go swimming, I can go swimming in the morning and it wouldn't matter what time of day. I'm yeah. always hungry after swimming. Same way. Just like any exercise, but swimming in particular just like makes you so hungry. Well, I guess this is our cap off to summer. love your earrings. Thanks, buddy. I got these as a birthday gift. Oh, I wanted to say happy fairy bladed. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. You're the eighth or the fifth. Fifth. You know what screws me up? I have another friend. Hers is on the eighth, so yeah. I always screw her up with your screw the, her oh, birthday up with it's yours. So good that you remember. So if I give it, I, if I get back to you a couple days, I think I wish you a happy birthday. I'm like, oh shoot, I, right? I don't mind. You always wish me a happy birthday, even if it's belated or anything. You're, what did you do aware. for your B day? Drink or two, yeah. yeah. I had a drink or two, and then I had some burgers and smokies, and then we had a little fire. Oh my! Oh, that's good. Yeah, it was really cool. Was Jen, uh, Was your sister there? No, she was. She was doing something else that night because that was just with my friends. But I also did like a family birthday, so I got my family together. We just did a dinner like that, so that was nice. One time, I should come over for a fire. I love that. Although it's kind of hard to tell because there's so many fires going on right now, burning in BC. I'm sure you guys have all heard about the devastating ones in Kelowna. Oh, and then in Hawaii, did you see the ones in Maui? Yeah, it's heartbreaking. It really you guys is. went to Hawaii, didn't you? Yeah, I've been a few times in Maui specifically. I think I've been to... Well, I mean, when you're there next time, if you see some stuff rebuilding, that's... It'll be different. Yeah. For sure, it'll be different. Which kind of breaks my heart, because I... That place that burnt in Lahaina, I used to go there all the time with my family, and those shops, and those restaurants, and just everything. And there's nothing there's now. nothing left. And that banyan tree, there's like a big banyan tree. I think it still might be holding up, but it's... But a big spawn of it's burnt. And the fall. No, I'm okay I'm good. Yeah. Okay. Cool. 
Maybe when we get out of the city, we can just use the A AC. Yeah. But anyway, the banyan tree's all screwed up now. I know, it breaks my heart. Once I heard about the banyan tree, they put it on the weather network. You know the weather network puts yeah. their weather stories on there. I don't really watch the news at all. But I mean, if it's weather news, I will. Only yeah. weather. Yeah. And then you had Hurricane that slammed Florida. What is it? Hurricane Ida or something? Ida, yeah. I think so. Yeah, it's pretty, pretty awful. And that hit Florida as a Cat 3. What? A Category 3 hurricane. Hey, I didn't, I didn't know that. That's the only reason why I wouldn't live in Florida due to that. Right. Makes sense. And then you had Franklin hit some parts of Carolina. And the and Atlantic Canada was actually on alert for that. Oh, yeah. For Franklin. Really? Well, this is the pick of the hurricane season, though. Yeah. Hailstorm. Sorry, I had to stop kind of quickly. This is camera. I know, too. that's why I didn't want to get a ticket. Oh, did you ever tell the fa my crowd the story? Remember when you were sliding on the ice, like when you're going, oh, trying yeah, to go out so at, in the winter, so dumb. So and they still gave her a ticket. Like, what were you gonna do? Well, because I couldn't stop, so I obviously kept going. But like I, I made sure I was you would have, you would have, and, and, and you know what? If you would have, if you would have stopped, you would have hit the barricade and told. She would have told her truck. Yeah, so I was being smart, and they still, still gave me a ticket. Like I'm obviously, I made sure no cars were coming or anything. But like the ice would have just slid me right. But into I mean, if you did that now with ice, you would have been had to bite the bullet and just pay the ticket, right? Yeah. But I'm like, if you did that now and there was ice like now, you would have been able to... Unless you were yeah. going 50. I wasn't... Well, yeah, I was going 50 at the time. I was only going... Like, I wasn't speeding even. But I'm just saying, if today there was ice, oh, yeah. you wouldn't have been able to... No, unless, unless you were going like 50, then it would have been fine. Yeah, maybe. It depends. Luckily, no ice yet. I would have rather pay the ticket than, to than have to pay for my truck. And this is 18 years old and... Yeah, damn. She's still rolling. We may think, uh, you know what, I was asking her if it might be a fluid issue or something. But I don't think it's that. older jeep something older so you're not putting a 30 grand down payment on something yeah i don't want to do that but at the same time i don't want to keep having to yeah. get maintenance done and stuff you know if it's like a really old vehicle she's a hundred whoops yeah danger ranger uh, she loves to pin Danger Ranger, and I know it's only a truck, but it's fast when you get it up top. So it goes. It definitely does. And then if you're hauling uphill, she would have no problem. Oh, yeah. No problem at all. Does it balance the clutch? I'm gonna eat so much. I'm so hungry. How about you?
Are these van shoes you have on? They're Converse. They're so similar to vans. They are kind of similar, aren't they? She always, me and her always dress casual when we're hanging out. Yeah, well, we usually have casual hangouts. We haven't really done anything that's like too fancy or upscale, you know? But I like that because I, I would rather do casual. By the one month period, when it gets to be over a month, we need our fix. Yeah. Or a month and a half, by the month and a half mark, we're ready to see each other. Oh, and I'm sorry, remember I canceled that day with oh, you, that's you fine. and Nick? I was just not feeling good. Oh, I had to. No worries. I woke up with nausea at like 7 in the morning. But that morning, I didn't go to bed till 5.30. Okay, no wonder. I, I don't know how you stay up so late. Like, I, my body gets so tired, I just have to fall asleep. But I find I don't do that much. The latest I go is maybe 4, 4 30. Still, that's so late. I know. But on some nights, like after a swim night, I don't make it past 1 o'clock sometimes because the swimming takes it right out of me. You certainly are a night owl. Like, I don't think I can even stay up till 1 o'clock every night, you know? starting to do it again we hung out last year at the end of August like five days before my birthday yeah. and we noticed especially up hills like at slow speed if we were going up hills the clutch was she still brakes very good the brakes on this thing is still and she has, um, unfortunately, she has a little rust in the back. Yeah, the back bumper, but, but it's been like that for a while. And, and know, um, that's the only one spot. And you're not going to fix it. And, I mean, down there now, I can start to notice at that spot where it's rusting really yeah. bad. Yeah, I might have to try and either fix that up or, or just, uh, you know... You're not going to spend 500 bucks just for that, right? No, 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 no. Unless it's affecting one of your parts, then you have to take care of the rocks. Of course, of course. But this is just on the back bumper, and it's really not that big of a deal. It should be fine. It's a nice road. Thank you for today. You're so sweet. You are too, buddy. I love you very much. Love you too. I don't know how many compliments I've given you since I met you. I've definitely lost track. 
But compliments are a big thing. You compliment me all the time, too. And honestly, you know, we got through COVID together. I mean, she, I just called her some days where I felt like I just wanted to quit on everything. Yeah, we got each other through. But we, we did her. We made her. We made her. Sure did. Yeah, and then we're gonna say goodbye now, and um, just gonna go home and watch football. Nice. Anyway, this is us signing off for today. Peace out. Peace out, guys. Bye. See you next time. Bye.